hello friends welcome to freeprojects.com and this is my another project bug tracking system and i have developed this project in java jsp and mysql and uh, for connecting the mysql with the uh, java and the jsp i have used the mysql connector which you can get it easily on the mysql.org website also uh, the front end design uh, i have used uh, html css and javascript uh, for de uh, designing the fronting part and you can see that I have used some of the jQuery library for creating the some banners and then uh, Some validations so you can see uh, this is the slider So I have used the jQuery library for creating this slider and this is a single role based system So there is only a single role that is the admin admin will be responsible for performing all of the operations there is no tester and there is no developer role this is very mini project and basic project so let's start with the functionality so this is the home page of the uh, of the project and i have added a slider here so you can uh, see that this is sliding and you can change the images from the front uh, from the back end for uh, just replacing the image and this is the about us section so this is just a little bit about the bug tracking system and after that administration administrator login and the contact us so i am not saving the the data of contact us into the database this is a static static contact us page so and the same menu is available above so you can navigate to the page from this menu also okay so let's i am going to uh, log in uh, inside the admin panel okay so i am entering the wrong user and password so it's saying that invalid user and name and password and if i enter if i don't fill the form then it's showing okay please fill in this field so these validations uh, has also been implemented with the jquery and i have used the jquery uh, validator plugins for this so let's log in with the admin so you can see this is the admin dashboard so admin can perform these operations so admin will be able to add users add projects and add tickets add tickets means bugs and the user reports and project reports and ticket reports and then change password so you can see the above menu has been changed okay so this is a role based system so once admin logins into the system then above menu will be changed automatically according to the role <coughs> So if I log out from the system, then you can see the above menu has been changed. And if I log in inside the system, then you can see the above menu has been changed. Okay, it's coming according to the user role and permission because there is only a single role that is the admin. So this menu is applicable for the admin only. So in other projects, we have one, two, three or n number of users. Then this menu will come according to their user role and permissions. Okay, so this is the admin dashboard and after that you can see this is the drop down menu and i have used the jquery plugins for this also so this is the add user page where admin will be able to add any number of users using their credentials means admin will be able to add any number of users here and after that there is a add projects so this is a bug tracking system so uh, yeah, so tester will assign uh, tester will log the bugs for the project so all the project you can create n number of projects from this form and then add bugs so this is the bug page so uh, tester or a user will be able to log any number of bugs inside that project so this is the project code this is the, and after that admin will be able to assign that bug to any user and bug type so this is a bug or this is a new functionality and what is the ticket status the pending qa release or uat release so these are the drop these all drop downs are dynamic drop down and all the values are coming from the database right so if you want to change the value then there is no need to change the things in the, into the code just change the values into the database or add the values into the database the drop down will be fetched automatically according to that database <coughs> okay so this is the add bug and then report so this is the user report and if uh, admin clicks on the edit then and the edit form is opting here and then project report so this is the edit and save project and after that bug report this is the edit and submit 
So this is a very small project, uh, the bug tracking system. This is a very mini and minor project, right? So, and I have developed it using the Java, JSP, and MySQL. And for running this project, you can easily run this project in Tomcat uh, Tomcat server as well as your NetBean server and your uh, Eclipse server. Also for operating system, you can host it into any of the operating systems such as Windows, Mac, and the Linux environment so okay so thanks for watching the video and don't forget to subscribe our channel freeprojects.com for getting the daily updates on the latest projects and thanks thanks for <laughs>